So, yeah. yeah, I'm not always sure how to handle these situations. Like, I mean, do you think it's rude to comment on someone's weight loss, Lindsay? <sighs> No, I don't think so. I think, I mean, obviously, like if someone's gained a lot of weight, like you obviously oh, wouldn't yeah. comment on that <laughs> clearly. But I think when it comes to weight loss, it's usually not a rude thing. It's usually, um, it's usually nice. Like, you know, I, you could say something like you look great, which right. doesn't have to be directly about the weight. Right. I mean, I think that generally people are happy when others recognize their weight loss, especially if it's, if it's a lot of weight. Like, right. and so th- this person, I think our listener said it was a lot of weight. So if it's like, oh, you lost like, so the person lost five pounds, they might be a little bit embarrassed if you say something uh, because maybe they weren't, they didn't know that people could tell that they had put on weight. <laughs> you know right, what I right, mean? Right, right. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's true. Mm-hmm. But I think if it's a lot, it's probably something that they worked hard on and oh, they, I think they yeah. will appreciate the an- acknowledgement generally. But I know I always feel funny in these situations. So, I mean, mm. but how do we say it? I mean, um, Moon, he said, um, you know, it's good. It, what Moon, he said is good, but maybe asking, did you work out as the first thing is like a little bit direct, right? And to just right. say you lost lots of weight, maybe these things are a little bit direct. I maybe would have said, like, you look incredible. Did you lose weight as an option to ask that question, right? But right, like right. you said, you could just say you look incredible. Um, But, you know, complimenting the person first before saying, did you work out, right? That will make them happy. Yeah, yeah. So just going to the more general comment first, like you look amazing, you look incredible, you look great. And then maybe asking something, did you lose some weight? Um, so that the weight is not at the very beginning. It's not all about the pounds and the weight and how they looked and look now. It's more about their being. Like if you say you look incredible, it could be about a lot more than just the actual size of their waistband, you know? Right, right, they right. Could- exactly. Yeah, you got to get that in there. Yeah. So they could look vibrant. They could look healthy. You know what I mean? It's a whole body thing. And you're right, Michelle, though. It is good to acknowledge it because they've, if you're going to lose like a hundred pounds yeah. or 150 pounds, you totally overhauled your lifestyle. You've made like a massive change. And I'm sure they would like to be acknowledged with that. Right. That if, if you, if you work so hard and then it's like nobody notices, <laughs> yeah. you know, I, I have a feel. I mean, you know, but everybody's different. Like this is just one of those things that everybody is different. And so like, you know, I was saying, I don't always know how to handle this myself. So I, you know, you really yeah. got to read the situation. Think about the person you're talking to. Well, I think one way to handle this is like, it's say something like uh, very benign, like say something like, oh, you look amazing. You know, did you lose weight? And then let them continue. Let them say something more if they want to. Right, right, right. right. I think that's a good point. Yeah. So, I mean, that's how I would answer this question. But, you know, I wanted to also talk about how could you answer? How could you talk about your own weight loss if you if you lost some weight? Right, Lindsay? Yeah, exactly. So if it were in my position, if I had lost weight, I could say one thing I could say is, yeah, I took off about 30 pounds. Right, wow. right, right. Or you could say like, oh, I shed a ton of weight by swimming or something like that. Yeah, by doing yoga or by like, yeah, doing like running marathons or something. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What's another one, Michelle? Um, You could say something like, oh, I've been working out a lot and watching my diet. So yeah, I have lost weight. Thanks for noticing. Yeah. So those are good things to say. I mean, yeah, I think the the key here is just let the other person talk. If yes. you're the one asking, just let right. them. And if they want to change the subject, let them do that too. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So yeah, I mean, I figured let's do a little role play. You know, we're showing how this conversation might go. Okay. Sounds good, Michelle. You ready? Okay. Yeah, here we go. Hey, Lindsay. Oh, it's been so long. Wow. You look incredible. Did you lose weight? Yeah, I did, Michelle. I took off about 20 pounds. Oh, that's amazing. Congrats. How'd you do it? Oh, well, I've been working out a lot and watching my diet, so it just slid off. That's awesome. Thanks for noticing, by the way. (laughs) Okay, sure thing. All right. So, (laughs) yeah, it didn't sound like you were offended here, did it? But of course, this is a make-believe situation. (laughs) <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> no, I, I, I don't think it's offensive. You know, to, for someone to say you look incredible, that's not offensive. That's 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 kind. Like that's um just acknowledging.